All right, everyone. So I just got the official uh, docking station for the Steam Deck. So this is how it looks like when it comes in. There's a little seal there. And yes, it is actually from Valve. Now I'm just going to cover that there for some information, but not too much with the box. But let's go ahead and open this up. Keep in mind, this thing is like 90 bucks. A little bit on the expensive side. And quite honestly, if I think what it is when I open this up, I'm going to say you might want to look at cheaper options. But let's go ahead and open this up. And see what we got. Um, I don't know why I was expecting this thing to be much bigger. Holy crap. Oh, okay. I mean, I'll, I'll give them credit. It's, it's small. It's, um, it's small. But it looks like there's other stuff in here. But keep it, okay. All right. So at least, at least they do give you a, a plug for it I mean honestly for the price keep in mind this is like 90 bucks and um, if it just came with this if it only came with this this would have been a complete complete ripoff but at least it comes with this so not as bad I guess um, so basically this is their official solution for the docking station and on the back here, as you can see, you got display port, HDMI, USB-C, but that's for the power, ethernet, and three USB-A ports. So, so yeah. Now, if you're curious how it looks like, let me, uh. Let me grab my Steam Deck. And let's see how it looks. So yeah, it's uh it's pretty on there. One thing I, I do notice is the, yeah, you can definitely tell they designed this strictly for the Steam Deck. There are third-party options out there, but a lot of times they kind of just make the, make the cradle a little bit on the generic side. This one, you can definitely tell they put some attention to details here. So this doesn't actually interfere with the glass panel. And on the back... It does not obstruct the vents over here. So at least at least there are some thoughts in this. So you can take the cable, plop it in, and it does conform to the um, to the plastic so that it doesn't like stick out too much. And let's see. Okay. Comes out with no problem like that. And just to give you an idea, that's how much slack there is on the on the cable for the Steam Deck. I primarily got this so that I can use this also to stream games online. Because I was just going to get a third party version, but I wanted to try out the first party one. And... My rule of thumb is personally for me, now you don't necessarily have to follow what I do, but when it comes to accessories, or in this case, docking stations, if there's going to be a first party option, I'm most likely going to lean towards that, even though you are kind of paying a premium for this. Like I said, there are third party options out there. 
that can do basically the same thing for much lower cost. Now, does it come with the power plug? Uh, that I'm not entirely sure. That's something you have to decide. But yeah, now I have an extra one. So, um, fun fact, I bought a separate power plug, the official one, for a charging cradle for next to my bed. And this one comes with one. So, now I have three of these. But anyway, this is the uh, docking station for the Steam Deck, the official one. This is just a quick unboxing, just to see how it looks. And uh, that's it. So, that's it. Like always, have a good one. And fun fact... I also picked up a brand new phone that I'm actually using to record this. This is the Google Pixel 7, not the Pro, but the regular 7. So if you're curious how video quality looks, well, here you go. Anyway, that's it. Like always, have a good one.